who approaches us, sisters? Does it look on us? Does it pity us? Make it leave us, sisters! Of voices we hear plenty! We were the Silken Sisters, the pride of Olenthodar. Sword and spell we wielded, six we were, but now are one. Six, six we were, and now but one. Will it free us? Will it kill us? Yes, a bargain, a story told, exchanged for peace. An end we crave, an end for true. Know that I do not believe it possible to destroy these spirits. They are bound to the King of Shadows, and as long as he exists, they shall as well. Does it know the Guardian? Does it know how the Guardian fell into shadow? We were the first, the first sent against him. Sharpened swords, sharpened spells, went into the forest where he was strong. Went in six, came out one. Went in six, came out one. He spied us in the wood. He fell upon us, drained our lives, and left our spirits naked, helpless. Left our souls screaming in the dark. But that wasn't all, was it, sisters? No, he was angry. He wasn't finished with us. Not yet. He scoured us bare, made us shadow. He can work shadow, shape it as he wills. He worked us like clay, like white hot steel. Six blades, hammered into one. Kill him for us. Show him justice. Show him pain. Here we came, by roads unknown. This place is strong with his contagion. Strong with his reek! When six were joined, some voices were lost. Mouths sealed, minds pulped. Three remain. The communion tree? Then it seeks to combat him. Come, sisters. Its hopes align with ours. Let us follow. My steel will strike true. <laughs>
Do I live? I thought not. You know why? No pain. Never fought a battle and came out feeling, well, feeling like this. Like nothing. Thunderbelly they call me, the Iron Arm of Dardath. First dwarf over the walls at Sunstone. Ha! The name's on account of my appetite, see? Got it from the boys on the field of Delambir. Here I was, smiting trolls left and right, and my belly's growling louder than me, on account of no breakfast. Good days those were. Oh, I'm all right. Always have expected I'd end like this. I like this world too much to leave. I like to eat and wench and belch and fight. I died in the battle, no doubt. The last battle. When all that remained of Ilfarn went out to meet the Guardian. They say we won, walled him up in some plane of shadow. But I don't call that a victory. Victory's when I swing my axe and split my foreman's skull. That was no victory, even for the worm. Of course not. The worm was on our side. A right hero he was. Wizards called him up from... Well, from somewhere. Said he'd come to put an end to the Guardian. Good thing we had him, too. He fought even tougher than he looked. Managed to distract the Guardian while the wizards did their work. Ended bad for him, though. The Guardian did for him, like he did for all of us. We saw him fall, just dropped out of the sky, all shining, like he was carved from diamond. The wizards weren't ready yet, so they sent us in next. Last I remember, the whole host of Dardath was marching forward, me and a few others at their head. Then, all around us, these little shadows, they were everywhere, hundreds of them. And one of them, he, he was just there, in front of me, all of a sudden, so close, so close, and he reaches for me, and... Not at first. I think I would have gone with the others. I could feel them, you know. Feel them drifting off, going somewhere. But not me. I made an oath. It was before the battle. Swore I wouldn't come home till the Guardian was slain. We all said the words. But I meant them. They beat him, those wizards did. They trapped the Guardian. I don't know how I know that. But I know. Aye, whatever you need. Thunderbelly's your dwarf.
won't both walk away from me. You must pardon me, friend. It was not my custom in life to greet visitors with swarms of undead. I am called Anias.